Captain Jack was an experienced astronaut who spent years exploring the galaxy. During one of his routine missions, he came across a strange object that appeared to be stuck in the moon's orbit. Curious, he decided to investigate. When he approached the spaceship, he saw a strange figure, the likes of which he had never seen before. It was a tall, slender creature with green skin and large black eyes. The alien seemed to be friendly, and Jack couldn't help but feel a sense of wonder when encountering such a being. The alien introduced itself as Astrodactyl, a traveler from the distant planet of Zeloria. Astrodactyl explained that they had been exploring the galaxy in search of new life forms, and had gotten caught in a gravitational anomaly that had left them stranded, they became separated from each other. Jack offered to help Astrodactyl get back on his way. During their conversation, they discovered that they had a lot in common despite their differences. Astrodactyl was fascinated by the land and its people, while Jack was fascinated by Zeloria's advanced technology. The astronaut takes Astrodactyl to the site of a meteorite that has previously struck Earth and perhaps knows its source and how to protect Earth in the future. To amuse the alien, Jack wanted to try out the water slide with him. But the alien did not know what this was and did not move from his place. However, their new friendship is soon tested when Astrodactyl is attacked by a xenophobe. Astrodactyl was kidnapped and taken to an unknown destination. When Jack returned, he did not find the alien. He looked around the place and did not find him. Jack realized that something had happened and as soon as possible he must look for him because he is a stranger here. Jack remembered that the alien had given him an advanced device as a token of friendship when they were on the moon. The advantage of this device is that it monitors the locations of aliens near you. So he kept roaming all over the city in search of a new friend. Suddenly, the signal started to increase as he approached a house in the city. He decided to attack. Here's the shock. He finds Astrodactyl in prison, looking desperate and sad. This evil kidnapper put the alien in prison because he hates strangers and feels that they will occupy the world. After feeling the euphoria of his control over the alien, this villain felt sleepy. This was in Jack's favor. But Jack decided not to go unless he punished this kidnapper. Yes! As they flew away from danger, Astrodactyl thanked Jack for his bravery and loyalty. The two of them knew that their encounter had been more than just a chance meeting. It was a bond forged in the face of adversity. Thus, Captain Jack and Astrodactyl continued their journey across the stars to return Astrodactyl to his group, knowing that they had each other's backs no matter what challenges awaited them. Their friendship was proof that even the vastness of space could not separate to kindred souls. The alien finally found his group, but he promised Captain Jack that they would meet again as soon as possible. <laughs>